welcome to another video tutorial in this video i will show you how we can draw violent plot using this sr plot website and we know that violent plot has many advantages compared to the box plot because in the box plot we can only just draw the numerical values but in the violent plot here you can see we can also draw the density of numerical values along with other data sets and here you can see it also gives us the information about the quartile here you can see this is the first quartile this is the second quartile or median and this is also the third quartile and here you can see the area is also showing the density of those values so in this video i will show you how we can prepare our file for drawing violent plot using this simple website but let me show you how we can approach to this website so first of all you can go here and write bioinformatics.com.cn slash en for english version and here you can see this sr plot website has many module and here you can see here we have the violent plot after clicking here you will see a box in this box you can paste your all data in the form of values to draw these violent plot and here is a file that how you can draw these values here in this file you can notice we have actually the three columns for this file and here is the first one you can see in the first one we have actually placed the treatments so you can notice in this example we have actually three treatments so number one is 0.5 ml number two is 1 ml and number three is actually the 2 ml and here each treatment has 20 replicates and the second column has consecutive values and this third column is totally optional if you want to use you can use and if you don't want to use you can simply leave it as such so when you have also prepared your file in this manner so you can just copy all these values you can go back to that website and here you can copy and paste your all values but if you have huge data then you can use this option but if you have huge data then you can upload your file using this option but keep in mind that your file should be must saved as tab delimited text file so here is the option for the figure size and here you can see we can adjust figure width let me adjust it to 10 and similarly figure height if you want to adjust it to 10 or 8 is would be simple here is the font size you can select you can select plot orientation should be vertical or horizontal similarly the inner mark you can select and similarly the split into halves when two groups and the grid line you want to show or not so i will leave this option to default if you want to change you can simply change and after that you can simply click here on submit here you can see now our violent plot has just been drawn and we can see you can see now our violent plot has been downloaded and here you can see this is beautiful violent plot you can also use for your own data so using this method you can also draw violent plot using this website and if you are facing any problem in the use of this website please let me know in the comment section thank you for watching bye bye